Okie dokie. So today we are doing rock bottom start with tainted loss. No, oh, 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 holy mantle. I asked if you guys still wanted to see this because it's it's kind of a different run. Uh, I, even though I did kind of have like an Eden's Blessing rock bottom moment a bit ago. You guys said you wanted to, so sure. So, so far, I believe on the list of things we've done so far, we've done Rock Bottom, it's Tainted Loss. We've done Glitch Crown, we've done Damocles, uh, that is just a troll bomb. And I think we've done Sacred Orb as well. It's up to your own judgment, based on these videos and how they go, to see, you know, uh, what you think would be the best start, assuming you get an early death certificate. I also think it's character dependent. We might have to do this again on, like, a different character. Maybe someone who has, that's really good, access to rerolls or something. Because, uh, you know, it really depends. There's no one good, like, oh, this is the item, right? It, character dependent. Longest seller fight in all of history. Oh my god. Alright, it's finally done. Thank god. Key there, that'll make me open that chest. And here we got Demon Baby. Nothing crazy. No real rock bottom moment, but it's okay. So my problem with the rock bottom is that oh, it really can do nothing on the entire run if you're unlucky. Or it could do literally everything for you. So this will be the tried and two test. Like what will happen today? A Widow fight will be nice and easy. We'll try and keep close so Demon Baby gets a bunch of shots in, increasing our DPS, making the fight end faster, and making so there's less chance of me getting hit. There we go. We'll probably go down for it, uh, just because there's more items, it's a little more exciting. Jesus Juice damage and range up is cool. We get some Wisps because of Beth's Faith, which is one of the only ways you can get any kind of defense as Tainted Law, so it's really good for us. There's our treasure room immediately with no enemies, cool. Pokeballs, like whatever. Oh! So this is kind of a, this is a little bit of a rock bottom moment, right? Oh my god! Sorry, I got a little nervous. So Lusty Blood increases your damage per enemy killed in the room and then resets per room. But since we have Rock Bottom, it's not gonna reset. Voodoo Doll is okay, but I'm tainted loss. I can't really uh, do anything with that. I just need to find a room with a lot of enemies and max out Lusty Blood, like kind of here. And now you can see we have 10 base damage and it isn't gonna go back down. Now in the question between Devils or Angels on this type of run, I think I'll go... I think I'll go Devil. Nah, I think I'll go Angels. Angel will be more fun, I believe. We'll take this, that's Planetarium Chance. That's actually not bad. Card against humanity is for money, maybe, in the future. Let me find my secret room and we'll go. I'm pretty sure this has to be it. It is it. It's a bunch of pills. It's a golden pill. Oh. Oh, I verped the tears up. Oh, hell yeah. I got really small. That's that's really good. I mean, lower smaller hitbox, right? That was an absurdly good golden pill for us. And we could not have gotten uh, any kind of stats down, even though I don't even think we did. Because we have rock bottom, so it was risk-free. And we're only gonna get really, really, really juicy items because we are tainted lost, who has the good old tagline of quote unquote better items. Yeah, right? Track this guy is actually really good. I, I I was reading comments and I saw a lot of people don't really even know what better items even means. Uh, I'll give it a little bit of a small explanation. Basically, the idea is that uh, they can't really get health ups because obviously health ups are useless to them. And they generally have a better chance of not getting any kind of bad quality item. That's, that's some absurdo damage actually. We actually got the angel? Cool. Perfection, again, we'll take it. It'll give us nine luck because we, I think, have minus one or whatever. It'll stay there and we'll get Eden's soul. I'm gonna take Eden's soul. Crack the sky. It was nice having you. I didn't use you actually, like, at all. <laughs> I used you once. Eden's soul could be a rig. I used it in the secret room. You know how this thing goes. Boss challenge room is juicy to me. Come here. I... I have to. I mean, I have a lot of spiders left, so it's gonna be okay. Oh, part of me wants to do that, guys. I'm not gonna lie. I... Oh! Relax. A ton of money for future shops is really nice. I... I gotta say, these guys, probably the least satisfying enemy to kill. Why you gotta... Why are they, like, the only enemy in the game where you gotta wait for a death animation that lasts longer than bosses? What's up with that? Never made sense to me. And a 9 volt, Sure. Typically, I, uh, I'm kind of a person that waits for rerolls before spawning stuff in the secret room, but I'm gonna be real. Seeing that 9 volt recharge everything straight up, and uh, I got kind of antsy. Kind of 9 tells us good. I kind of want to try it right away. Okay. Nothing in here. Use it. Oh! Okay, dude. It's pretty good. <laughs> it's pretty good. We also got balls. I didn't even mention it, but we do have balls. So now, we can get stats up, which is great. Oh, hey! It's the perfect scenario! Crack the sky stayed! Alright, awesome. Am I really gonna risk it all for a little bit of Mind's gameplay? Of course I am. What kind of gamer would I be otherwise? 
All right, focus up time. Do not waste your wisps. In here we have mulligan, which is just really good in general. Oh, okay, I was a little afraid that the other item would be kind of godlike. Listen, if there was any doubt that I didn't have a fully maxed Lusty Blood on this... Oh ho 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 ho! Uh, now would be the time to max out Lusty Blood. Worst room ever conceived in Isaac. How dare you. There you go. I actually did not have Lusty Blood maxed out, but now we do. We have 14. 14 base damage. Give me a bit of tier 8 and we're chilling. Another holy card. This would just be a good tainted loss run actually. So that's the thing about uh, Rock Bottom, it seems like, is like, yeah, it will be powerful. Of course it will be powerful. I'm sorry, is that two lost card? Okay. It, of course it will be a powerful run. Uh, you know what? I know it's like new, not really part of the challenge. I'm just going to use it just to see what's inside of here. Okay, it wasn't worth it. Yeah, it's like you could just straight up get stats and that's cool. You might not get the most OP, but it's guaranteed to be a, a good run. That being said, that does not mean this is not a powerful run, because obviously it is. We have 14 base damage. Give me a red stew, I'll freak out. PhD is cool. Feels like I'm walking on sunshine. Uh, hey, listen, for I, all, all of those uh, curse room haters, the fact that I used mantle to get in the curse room, I would have been able to get inside anyway, because I have the pill. Yeah, all right. It's okay, as long as we get through this, if I notice even a, like a slight hint of me getting hit, like here, but I think I'm okay, I'm going to press Q. Uh, it's okay because, whoa, we have Sacred Orb. So I'm almost certain that probably we'll get something good here in the future. Whether it be stats or whether it just be, uh, just a god tier effect. Oh, you're trying to give me a heart attack? And I actually didn't need to press Q. Cool. Divorce Papers is decent. It's a good tears up. Nothing else to do on the floor. No angel room. Probably uh, should be not even needed to be mentioned how much Beth's faith is literally carrying me. I know it's one of you. Or it could be the pile. Oh, I love you. Thank you. You're so much easier. <laughs> oh, alright. So you want me to go devils, huh? Understood. Well. Da oh, 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 okay, dude. Alright. There's a lot of overlap happening between these runs is what I'm noticing. You give me Damocles, I'll find Rock Bottom. You give me Glitch Crown, I'll find Sacred Orb. Is this like just like the holy, the holy four items? And if you guys are enjoying this like series of, oh, what, what item would just like be cool to start with? You know, let me know uh, other items. They don't have to be crazy items that like will obviously make the run good. Or they could be, you know? I mean, God, I could start with a Brimstone if you guys wanted me to. And just see how the run turns out like that. Uh, obviously the correct play here is Steam Sale, then buy there's options, then buy this because balls moment. Alright, Damocles, do your thing. I am not doing that. I never, ever, 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 ever. I know I have rock bottom, it's not happening. No. <laughs> Forget me now. Oh! Let's get that. I don't have, yeah, I, I'm sorry, I just, I do not have explosive immunity. That is a golden bone burning, burnt burning. So I think in terms of like scaling, maybe rock bottom is really good. Ah, oh, end game. But I think it really depends on if you get stats or not. And right now we're not. So while it's a good run, it's definitely not as broken of a run as you could get if maybe when you got death certificate, you started with sacred orb or glitch crown. I could be wrong. Maybe I'm just unlucky. Uh, I mean, that certainly helps. Oh my God. Damage up. Huh? Well, here's what I'll do. How about this for a giga damage up? Let me do, oh, this is perfect actually. So let me do this, then hold this, copy it, and then use the Empress itself and gain 27 damage. Now that is the type of rock bottom stuff I wanna see. There you go. All right. So our damage is now set. Last treasure room of the, oh! I mean, the obvious choice is here, right? We take tech and we take homing tech. Now, plop a soy milk in my face, I'll freak out. I don't know if I really want to explore the rest of this because it is kind of scary. And I'm terrified of this room. Oh my god, he spawned on me. That was almost terrible. I'm not too sure where I want to use this forget me now. I guess I'm just bringing it with me to bring it with me. Uh, logically, the best place would be. Yeah, honestly, these rooms are getting kind of scary. And I was lucky enough for it to even be Mausoleum and not Gehenna. So we'll just check this. And go? Wait, no, wait, 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 this is important, right? I have demo. Damocles will reroll the item. Or it'll give me an extra pedestal, which will be part of the secret room pool. Oh! Oh, oh my god! Alright. Alright. Now we're in hyper focus mode. We have a, unironically, like a, a run. We have a run. And here's all the tears up I asked for, except I'm pretty sure I'm at maximum tier rate. So I shouldn't have taken the shot speed up. I'll take the size down. School bag. Wow. I mean, sure. 
Glowing Hourglass, and Mama Mega. Well, Glowing Hourglass wouldn't do anything because I don't have a mantle to hold. Mama Mega could make it so I could do two boss rushes, I guess? I mean, I'll take it. Oh. Or you could just give me that. Boom. Yeah, those are good. Take this, just because balls and it gives me a bunch of money, and we'll continue the roll. Sure, this will be great for us in the future. I'm probably gonna die. Nice. And compass for mapping. All right. So we just buffed ourselves heavily and the buff wasn't very apparent right away. But what it is, is it's very good for after we are key. We've gotten some crazy things like no curses, more options for the treasure rooms, plus Damocles, school bag, Mama Mega on the next uh, R key, and just straight up mapping. So maybe this will work out for uh, oh, obviously you, and then obviously you, right? Take the luck up even though it does nothing for me. If I find perfection again, then it will do something for me. And you know what? Since that 2020 showed up, I, I'll check it out. Why not? I'll see what's inside. What's in here? Ocular Rift. This can save my life. It's absurdly good. And then here it's Matt's Kidney Stone. Oh my literal god. Does this even work? I don't think so. Oh my god, it does. I almost walked into the spikes. Oh my heart. Okay, so now we've we've achieved Giga. This is the type of rock bottom thing you want. You give me a Matt's kidney stone, I'll go to town. I, I I don't know if you guys know how fast I have to tap to make this like worthwhile, but I am tapping my keys like a madman. I see that blank rune there, and I'm curious as to what it is. I don't think it would be bad for it to be just like straight. Oh my God, who's alive? Oh, it's you. Oh, thank God. I don't think it would be bad for it to be a per throw. I'm down to maybe reroll. These are all great. But maybe I can go for more? Oh my lord, it's tough love! Perthro? No, it's a Hagalaz. Okay, well. Uh, I guess I'll take money equals power. And conjoint progress. Okay, goodbye. So much- uh, Sure, sure. Soy milk. Soy milk, you could probably just- Like, you could hold down the button and shoot. I gotta tap my keys. It's a little uncomfortable. But I'll make it work. Okay, and here we have- the best thing here would be Rotten Tomato, and then I guess Mystery Sack. And then here we have Rubber Cement, which would be Goofy. And these I don't really care about, but I think Chubby's cooler. Oh, cool. Nice. A soul of Apollyon. Can't wait to explode because of an orange fly. I'm just gonna send it. I mean, we should have a lot of damage. Okay, yeah. We should have an absurd amount of damage. Wow! I didn't know. I did not know how good it was. I wasn't able to test it. But it's really good! Rock bottom, uh, kind of coming in clutch towards the end here. Thanks to the compass, we know exactly where to go. We don't have to worry. Rubber Cement putting a lot of work, especially in that Hush fight. It was bouncing back and forth against Hush. I know he was coping, for real. So I'm assuming that this should be completely fine, just like the Hush fight. The way you deal with Satan is uh, you hope that he dies before he can stomp down and shoot a Kamikaze fly at you. There you go. We did it! We achieved that strategy. Let's go to the negative in our key and have more fun. Boom. Stubble. Eh. Puppy, we don't need. Eh, these are all whatever. That's conjoined. That's good. What an orange run. What kind of orange run is this? Kind of like the idea of just walking in a room and just being immediately invincible. Because Sigil Bathmit's entirely broken. Oh yeah. Another chest. Just make sure. Oh, isn't this like a fat buff? Yeah, it is. It's supposed to be a damage buff. I am confused. But it's just a hitbox buff for us because we've already hit our damage cap. Those two items have made this the Cheeto run. I've never had the Cheeto run on Isaac before, but I really like it. I am vibing with the Cheeto run. That much I can say for sure. I almost don't want to lose it. Oh yeah! Alright, more shots. I can't do that. So what did we learn in boating school today? I think we learned that at the end of the day, truly, there is no right answer. Anything can get you OP, as long as you play correctly. Does that mean that you're not allowed to have preferences? Of course not, you can have preferences. I still think I prefer Glitch Crown over everything. But I mean, look at me now, that Sacred Orb run did better than the Glitch Crown one. Anyway, we're not even close to being done, despite me sounding like it. Let's go Arky and have fun. Cheetos! Oh, ho, 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 ho. Take you. I'm just like... Trucking around cheese puffs for a living. Why, why am I broken? I can't shoot. Oh, there you go. That's that's fair. 
I'm not gonna lie, it looks like I'm shooting more than I am. I, it feels like I'm shooting 120 tier rate. Let's go normal floors today. Just because we went all floors last time. Oh! Well, I think the obvious answer is we take this. We're not gonna take knife. That's That would be kind of bozo, I think. I'm gonna take the knockout. I'll just can save my life. Restock is great. We'll smelt these. So I'm not sure why, but I think I literally broke my Matt's Kidney Stone. Whenever I release it now, I literally don't shoot for the duration of it active. I can only shoot once it's over now. I don't know why. This doesn't want to walk. You know, I haven't made a video on Mega... What just happened? I haven't made a video on Mega Blast, actually. Maybe I should do that. It's such a rare item. No one talks about it. $3 bill, this will kill me 100%. I'm not gonna take either of these actually. I'm trying to not die. What, what do you, oh, that's, I have a literal flamethrower. It's so pretty. It's so pretty. It's, it's, it's undeniably pretty. And in here today we get D8. Oh yeah. Uh, D8 over the D8. And let's take Nancy bombs because they make me laugh. And we'll try and reroll our multiplier over and over and over again. I don't think we can, but I mean, I don't know. This is tough. It's a weird decision because you might be able to get a crazy multiplier on your tears or something, but so far it actually just looks like I have 50 range. Oh my god. And holy light! That is literally a flamethrower. I have a cheese at flamethrower. I've never seen a synergy like this. This is honestly straight up awesome. That is so cool! Look at what I'm shooting! Look at this! What? I've never seen this in Isaac! Hold on, I need to appreciate this. This looks so awesome. Uh, oh, whatever. Oh wait, no, I can get to have both. Oh, never mind. We're sick. GG. Crooked penny. Oh my god. Oh wait, 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 wait. I just took red stew. Did I do it? Oh, okay, that's fair. Also, we picked up a birthright, and I guess I have a soul Lazarus now. Listen, I know the whole point was like, oh, don't. Uh, I can't even see. Don't, don't get any mantle. And I, I'm, or listen, it's different now. It's different. Cause now I want to see how the run ends. In here, a uh, continuum might hurt my eyes, but we're gonna do it anyway. Nice camo pants here. Nice mutant spider here. No matter what shows up in the boss room or boss rush, I will just straight up damn cleaze it. Or sorry, I'll crooked penny it. I so badly want to take it. Oh! I'm gonna die. Le le oh! oh, oh, oh. I, I used it again. Did I get more? What's going on? I duped it again! Again. Oh, it's gone. It's all gone. C-section was there. Who cares? I don't even... What's going on? It's over. Dupe. Uh, why do I keep getting the dupes? I found an Eve's Mascara for more damage. Boop, boop. Oh, yeah. No, that makes that a perfect sense. Roll. Okay, yeah. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Yep. 100%! Just keep doing it! Give me a Mega Mush! 700! 700 damage. 900 da actually 900. <laughs> Eden's Blessing, yay. Can't wait to see how this turns out. 1000 damage. I don't even know how I'm getting more damage, but it's happening. Alright, you know what? I'm over it. I got 1000 damage. I don't even care. Let's just go. We'll get the D-Infinity and Godhead. Because of course I needed Godhead on top of everything. I see no reason why not. Because we're going to walk in here, we're going to be invulnerable anyway. Because I'm going to use my Mega Mushroom. This turned out to be uh, uh, quite the GG. Oh! That was what. this is one shot. I, I have not moved, I haven't touched anything. That was one shot. One. Let me shoot again. Maybe I missed. Okay, I think I got him, guys. And that's it. GG. There are a bunch of pickups. No delirium. Holy moly, rock bottom, right? That's it. Simple as that. Ah!